Coming up next, a step-by-step -step guide for installing SQL Server 2019 on a virtual machine running Windows Server 2019. Today we're installing SQL Server 2019 CTP 2.3. Our virtual machine is running Windows Server 2019 and configured with four virtual CPUs, 24 gigs of memory, and two local hard drives. These are the prerequisites for SQL Server. Let's go ahead and get these installed. The prerequisite installations are now complete. The virtual machine should be rebooted before continuing. Now we attach the CTP ISO and start the SQL Server installation. Select Installation on the left, then New SQL Server Standalone Installation. This is the SQL Server Install Wizard. Select the Evaluation Product Key, accept the License Terms, and enable Microsoft Updates. On this screen, we can select the SQL Server features and change the default install directory.
accept the default instance ID and service configuration. On this screen, we need to select the SQL Server Administrators and verify the default install directories. Here we can review the SQL Server features and configuration. Now we're ready to start the installation.
The installation is now complete. Here we can verify all of the features installed successfully. After a quick reboot, we can verify the SQL Server services are running. The last bit of software we need to get installed is SQL Server Management Studio. Now we open Management Studio and create a simple query that displays the SQL Server version number. We now have a virtual machine running SQL Server 2019.